Okay, Steve, let's start with the uh, the really bad news. And Dan, how, how's he doing? Yeah, he's not great. His, his nose is pretty uh, pretty busted and uh, there's some stitches in there. And he's dazed. You know, he was out cold. You know, swallowed his tongue, so a little bit frightening. Uh, he's recovered now. Sat up in the dress room and day okay. You know, he, I think he'll just drive home or someone will drive him home and he'll be fine. But, it, you know, Nathan goes in, 17 years of age, and, and I thought it was excellent. Mm -hmm. If I'm honest, looked accomplished. His, his kicking was good. Didn't look phased, you know. Made an error in the second half, and it was a little bit hold your hands up. But he didn't didn't look at all like it was uh, something that bothered him. Mm -hmm. Cleared it out of his mind well, and and, and continued made some good saves, um, and, and really should have, you know, we shouldn't have conceded that third goal. Mm -hmm. You know, it was a 93rd minute, and it was our corner, and they broke on us. And uh, yeah, it would have been nice if Nathan had gone in and not conceded. But he, he, I was pleased with him, mm -hmm. uh, and, and upset for Dan. You know, it's it's a. Uh, a big day for him and it was over in half an hour yeah and so we, we got off to a, a poor start we didn't recover from really did we no no it was a wake up call in that respect Barry in, in as much as uh, you know you can trundle through pre-season it can be lovey dovey and pats on the back but time and time again I've said to this group that Ryman Premier Football Blue Square South Football is no different and Conference Premier Football is no different you've got to do the physical battle first and you've got to win it and you've got to win the, the ball in the back in the right areas and you've got to win those knockdowns from your defence and from their clearances. Uh, and once you do that, you can control territory, you can get the ball down and play. Um, and the first half, in particular, second half I was pleased with, but the first half in particular was just we got beat up. Mm -hmm. And we didn't cope with the balls in behind, we didn't cope with the knockdowns, they won the second balls. And as soon as the goal went in after five or six minutes, you could see their tails lift. Mm -hmm. You know, I, th I think both, both teams started the game with you know, a little bit in anticipation of what was coming. Mm -hmm. uh, and then when the goal went in, I think they grabbed the ball by the horns and it lifted them and it knocked the stuffing out of us a little bit. But um, like I said, second 45, I, I was pleased with in as much as the response, in as much as we played some good football, in as much as we, uh, y you know, competed and it was nip and tuck, mm -hmm. uh, which is what we, it should have been from the start. We shouldn't have been battling from 2-0 down. Mm -hmm. And there were some, some good signs there for the second half that you can take into Wednesday? Oh, absolutely. Listen, we've put together this squad, Barry, and, and, and we, we just feel that there's going to be learning curves and they're going to be steep and sharp. Mm -hmm. And that's a, that's a huge learning curve for the youngsters in as much as they, you know, four or five of these players have barely played Ryman Premier Football. Mm -hmm. And they're going to have to learn quickly. And if they don't, you know, we'll have to make changes. But I want to give these guys an opportunity. I think they've shown second half that they can compete. Mm -hmm. They have got something to offer. Um, but they're just not used to Ryman Premier Football. Um, I still firmly believe that over a period of time, whether that be four, six, eight, twelve weeks, that this, this side will unite, will gel, will get better. They'll understand their roles better. They'll understand what's required of them in a Ryman Premier uh, match in terms of, you know, it's not all beautiful football. It's just not. 80% of it is, is muscle, bite, fight. And, and winning territory, and win, uh, you know, and gaining possession of the ball in, in, a, in a horrible manner. Once you have, you know, can we play? But today, the first 45 was a, was a wake-up call for the guys that haven't haven't experienced on the Premier Football. Great, thanks, Steve. No worries.